Okay, and we're recording. Welcome to some Roguebook gameplay with Dark Zero. So, let me just get started here. Uh, the audio should be good now in the game. Just testing out some OBS settings. I think that's about perfect. So, let's jump into something. What's progression? Is this unlocking stuff? Uh, yes, I think this is just levels. Uh, we don't need to mess with that. Let's look at some settings. Quality. Ultra, very nice. Resolution, we can't change. Um, borderless, let's just go with full screen. Hopefully it doesn't mess with the video. Mute in the background. Sure. You know what, let's turn that off actually because if I do jump over there to Steam or something, it'll still play the music, which is nice. Okay, oops, let's get started. So this is a new um, roguelike deck builder. So lots of them coming out lately and it's kind of kicked off with Slay the Spire. Monster Train was a great follow-up. Uh, a lot of things jumped off from there. We got Ring of Pain. Oh god, there were there were a few last year. There's Griftlands that I really want to try out. This one kind of has a board. So this company actually Abra Abracum Abracam. I'm not sure. Oh god, it really didn't tell me anything here. So let me walk over to Mr. Turtle. Hello there, young one. All right. Okay. Well, let's go to the rat. Okay. Let's go to uh, this red boy. Uh, Sirocco. Versatile, bulky body, can shield allies. Sounds good. Well, we don't think we can recruit anyone else, so why not? So yeah, so this is um, from Abracam, the, the, the Belgian company that made Feria. Feria was uh, a little bit weird because it was it was a card board game hybrid. Uh, where actually, much like this, where you'd see a lot of... Um, you'd build out tiles and you'd collect these kind of energy crystals. So very similar to what you're seeing. Oh. Inside the road book. Magic brush to paint the world around you. Find treasures and gems. Awesome, okay. Build a strong deck, yep. Once in battle control, two heroes. So we are, I guess we're always gonna start with uh, this uh, this warrior knight lady and the f red frog man. I really don't know what he is. Uh, so we can swap to tank damage, it sounds like. Each victory in battle rewards you special ink. Oh, okay, cool. Cool theme. Once you feel ready, enter the final portal and confront the boss. Okay, so it's up to us to explore and, and move on to the boss. That's cool. Can we move all around here as much as we want? It's not like random battles, is it? Uh, pay gold to draft a card. We obviously want to do that. So, first time I've played this, really have no idea what our deck kind of consists of right now. Let's have a look. So, two attacks. Two defense, a uh, stronger attack. They all cost one. I don't know if that's. I, I don't know. If that's mana cost, I guess. More attacks. Oh, but that's with the other person. And one defend for him and a bigger defense. Cool. So, what kind of stuff do we want? We want draw. We want card draw, I guess, more than anything. Only if Sirocco is leading and you haven't played any cards this turn, attack the leading enemy for 12. It's nice because it's zero. We can only use it when the other guy's there, though. This is two. Probably too much right now of mana. Gain seven block if you control an ally. What does that mean? How do you control an ally? Would you not always be in control of an ally? I guess these are upgrade slots also. Um, uh, seven block. I mean, five, five. We've got seven down here. If you control an ally, gain 11 block instead. That sounds nice, but honestly, I have no idea what that means. Let's, let's go with it anyway. Uh, two courage, what's courage do? At the start of the turn, gain one energy and lose a stack. Alright, so that's extra mana over time. Let's go with some block for now so we don't die super early. See what this guy's offering. Uh, okay. Oh no, he's a fight? Oh no. So we still have some gold left. Uh, attack for four, for zero, attack for seven, add a dagger. Is that going to be like uh, something we can use? Kind of right click it and not buy it. I want to know what dagger is. Doesn't show me when I hover it. Okay. Well, ooh, no, let's leave that shot, please. Let's not spend anything right now. Let's just have a battle. Yeah, so basically, uh, in, in Ferry, you would like jump and find kind of energy crystals like this, and they would give you more mana or, or something like that. God, it's been a while since I played it, but it was, it was actually really interesting. It was really cool. I actually know the, uh, the community manager for Ferry. I used to stream all the time. Uh, we used to play. We used to play Final Fantasy the card game together. And but the, the 
What thing that interests me the most about this game is Feria have actually worked with Richard Garfield. So I brought with me today my lucky Richford, Richard Garfield, PhD. Magic the Gathering card for good luck. So, oh, okay, so it's going to show us this guy is going to buff and these guys are going to attack with five each. So what we want to do is at least have uh, ten defense, right? Swap to the front. Okay. Hero share a total block. So we want to defend first. What if we swap this guy to the... F Let's not do that because we can attack for nine with this person. So we'll attack for nine. Then we'll swap to the front and add extra. Okay. So we shouldn't take any damage and that's the end of our turn. What's all this stuff? Uh, scrolls. What do scrolls do? Revealed final boss. Oh, so it also tells you takes at most 10 damage per hit strikes with a flurry of attacks. Okay, so we want we want some defense. Discard pile, dissolve pile. That's destroyed cards, I assume. Okay. Well, we still want more blocks. If we could kill this guy, it'd be very nice, but we don't. We have 10 block. We're going to take two damage at least. But I don't think we can kill this guy. We'd have to attack twice. What's this two fire? That just buffs him, just two extra damage. Okay. Well, yeah, we're gonna have to we're gonna have to use both as blocks because we don't want to take early damage. We'll gain another block, and then we're gonna do oh 11 damage. I don't know why um, this keeps going up. This charge, lunge. So lunge must do something special, which is pretty nice. We're only gonna take two damage here, which is what we wanted. Sweet. Unfortunately, she took it and she has way less health. Oh, that's our new card. So, if you control an ally. I really still don't understand what that means. Some some card text is going to be an issue. Getting 11 block instead. So, let's strike for... This guy's going to keep buffing. We really want to get rid of him fast. Unfortunately, we don't have any more. Let me do this. It. I think it means it just swaps and then blocks. Um, but let's just leave that guy at the front for now. Can't really do anything else. Unfortunately, no attack cards. Okay. Lunge. Let's read. Charge. Swap this hero to the front. Attack for eight. We want to do that for sure. In fact, we should probably just... Six. Six. Eight. I don't know what that charge does. We need to figure it out. It's giving her some benefits. Some fire. No mana, no damage. One attack and this guy's done for. Oh, okay, so if oh, if she's leading, she gains three power. Why was I not looking at that? Because they're usually six. And leading must be if you start your turn at the front, I guess. Uh, at the end of your turn, if he's leading, gain two block. Ooh, okay. Okay, okay, I'm getting this. Might as well just kill this guy. Sad because they're pretty cute little yaks, actually. Yeah, so I mean, uh, Feria was 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 a was a really interesting game. Uh, it felt very weird. It, it did feel like you had to control these grounds more than card play. Um, Richard Garfield. If anybody's going to make a card game, it's going to be Richard Garfield. Uh, an interesting card game. I was actually just playing uh, Robo Rally, one of his original old board games recently. Uh, consumes a brush. Reveal all spaces in a three tile range. Okay, nice. And this is... Oh, okay. Press space to do that. So we can do that whenever we want. Let's go and see this first. Okay, so we can also head down there. Can we even get through to that? What is that? Okay, come on, lady. Let's move. Uh, can we move over this? Can we move down here? I... Looks like it. Looks because it's green. Let me just try. No, you cannot because this is now red. Oh god. Okay. Well, that was a waste. Never mind. Let's just get let's get to that thing. There. Transform your cards. Transmute card. Does that mean upgrade? We're gonna have to find out. It's awkward because you really want to be, yeah, you want to be like on this thing here where you, oh, hello. Also 150. Hey, no, 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 leave. Let's do this. 
Yes, use that. Got all this gold. Feels weird because I'm running around in this space and I don't know why, but I feel like I'm going to be attacked elite. Damn, uh, I'm going to be attacked like a, like it's an RPG. Sky, oh, okay, so they reveal more. Yeah. Elite battle. We don't want to do these elite battles right now. This deck is pretty, pretty poor, I suppose. 40. Okay, charge. Swap it to the front. That's what charge does. Okay, attack the leading enemy for 12. That's pretty nice for one. Especially if we use her, because then she'll be 15 when she's leading. Yeah. Uh, outlaw. Ranged. Add a dagger to your hand. And this loses one spirit. Okay, an ally, so it brings out somebody else into the battlefield. They attack for their attack value, so for three. Alright. Range, this enemy costs one energy less when played from the back. Cool, very cool. That's going to be a zero cost help. Um, spirits, spirit allies can... What spirit? I'll lose one spirit. Allies can have abilities to value if an ally hits zero spirits. Unsummoned, I assume it's also, it's its health also. Uh... So it's like a 3-3. A three, three. Ally aggressive. Whenever this gains spirit, gain three times as much. That's cool. Can gains spirit. Uh, can we give it spirit? Aggressive deal damage equals this size spirit front and mid end of each turn. It's it's cool, but we don't have any way to gain spirit right now. And this guy would be for free. So I feel like we would want to jump on this ally. Uh, grab that coal, that gold, what's this over here? Oh, it's actually a weapon, what? Oh, it's gonna be one of these upgrades or something. Maybe we can give it to another character. Okay. Interesting. So this guy's skipping his turn. I don't like him though, being at the back over there with his bow and arrow, that's gonna be dodgy. Outlaw. At the start of your turn, add a dagger to your hand and this loses one spray, yes. When played from the back. So how do I play it from the back? How do I play it from the back? Is that when I move back? This guy's gonna buff himself. What we really want to do is... Damage as much as... Oh, as much as possible. I should have probably tried to attack this arch, to be honest. Um, we want to swap. And now, the main character's at the back. So that's what it means. And now we can play this guy for free. Uh, special cards that fight alongside you. Yes. And he's just on the ground here in this weird JPEG. Uh, I don't see any... Well, when she leads, she does more damage. So let's just let's do that. Let's get her in front again. We don't need the defense, but why not? Oh, he defends both of them. Not good. Not good. Attack for five. Dissolve. Yep. Retain. Okay. Okay, well, I think I did screw up because I really, really think we should be attacking this fella at the back. Whilst we can. Uh, and that would have been... I could have, almost, could have probably killed him this turn as well. Really silly. So, 6. We're taking to 11. That's not going to be enough. 9. You know, why don't we just... Why don't we just uh, defend twice and not mess around? So, when I end my turn, this should go up by 2. Should go up to 18. Yes. Alright. Okay, this guy's going to do 6. We're going to get another dagger. Strike. And charge. Attack for 8. So, hmm. Game 5 blocks. Not going to be good enough. Attack for 2? Oh, because when she's leading, she gets... Okay, so we want to keep that in hand for now. What we want to do is... Well, we can't kill this guy because it's 6, 12, 18. Or we could. We could. 6, 12. No, 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 no. And then we'll do this. And we'll quickly finish you with dagger. Now she's ready for next turn. Sweet. We got another dagger off this guy. Last one before he pops. And he's gone. So, guard. 7 block. Seven block, block. 9. Nah, I want to hit him with the dagger. You've got to get him with the dagger first. Easy. Very nice. So much easier. I feel like I'm better at games like this when I'm actually talking to a, even just a camera. 
because you kind of walk yourself through things. Reveal three tiles in a straight line. Well, that is absolutely perfect. Uh, I, how do I face this lady over here in a straight? Can I? Oh, okay, here we go. I need to pick where I go. Oh my god! <laughs> this thing. Why did I do that? I meant to do another straight line. What did I just get? A scrap of paper. Ooh, th th three bleed. I like I like stuff like that. I like poison. I like bleed. But we've got no other ways to do that right now. Combo. The other hero. This costs one less energy. Ah, that's cool. That's really really cool. Uh, the next two hits on an enemy are critical hits. Double damage is pretty nice, but honestly, making this a one cost, and we do already have a lot of block though. I'd like to get this and then remove a block, to be honest. That's what I'm gonna do. Let's try and take this, uh, pick it up. Whenever the equipped hero deals 15 damage with a single attack, it's gonna be her if anybody. Oh, she gets, okay, so she gets both. Cool. Okay, so we want to try and go here. And you can just walk through this house for some reason. Let's draft another card. Double an enemy's bleed stack, sir. <laughs> oh, it would have been good to know that before. We could have bled them for three, then use something like this to make it six plus four. That's that's a great card, but now it might not be as useful. Retreat can only play it while she's leading. That's great. Because it helps us swap again, and then we can go back to that combo. Give a power, uh, give a hero three power. It's nice, but I think. I like now can I please destroy a card? That's really all I'm looking for. Buy a random gem. I can't not. I'm new to the game. I can't not do that. Um. Oh. Oops. Okay. Oh, I should not have done that. I didn't realise. Okay. Well. That you can level up, I guess. You can level up, it looks like. Yeah. Oh, and you can start people at the front, it looks like. Okay, so this is when you sort things out. I wish I, <laughs> I would have read those. I just kind of clicked on it. I don't know why. Awkward. Um, buy a random gem. I can't not do that. I need to know what's going on. When you play this, add a copy to your hand. Sure. All deal final. Goodbye. We have this room. Oh! Oh my god. Okay, so we put one of these in here. So, what we would. Ooh, that's interesting because he was really nice. And I would not mind having two of him out getting two daggers every time. I do also really like that and this. This is pretty great kickflip. But it adds it to your hand as soon as you do it. So I think I'm going to add it to the outlaw. Is that not how you do it? Oh, yeah. So you click on the card, you click on the gem. Add a copy to your hand with no gems. I don't know what that means. Oh, all right. So yeah, obviously a downgraded version of it. Yeah, sure. Sweet, let's go. Next battle. Okay, so we would like to strike, swap, outlaw, outlaw, attack. Oh, and actually it just does, it just puts the same guy down, just buffs him up. So that's how we would increase the spirit um, by having same card. So same thing. That gem on that other card would have been really good because whenever you give him more spirit, he gets three times as much. So that would have been awesome on that other card. Unfortunately, we didn't know that. So Combos, they're coming together. This is interesting. This mechanic of, of kind of ducking and weaving using these other... Hey, where's... Oh, it's still only going to give us one dagger. It's not two at a time. It's not two separate entities. Okay. So. We want to charge... Dagger. Uh, nothing else here, really. We should probably just 
Throw that, throw that. We don't want this guy to go to the front right now. Because we're going to get another dagger. Oh my god, okay. Well, we need to kill this guy quick time. I think we can do it quite easy. 18. That's what I'm talking about. 18. We're going to block. And we're going to block. And then he's going to get two extra block. So we're still going to take four damage. Still going to take four damage. But he's got a lot of health. He's very tanky. We should be fine. Cool. Right. How do we jump to the front? Retain. Yep, yep, yep. We know these two daggers. That's going to give us ten damage with this guy. But honestly, right now, we're in a pretty poor position. What we need to do is... We need to somehow jump her to the front. And then we can... Then we can teamwork. This jumps him to the front. Ah, uh, you know, do we do we take a hit? Do we block again? Maybe he's gonna sleep? No, let's just, let's defend. Let's see what's gonna happen. There's no point. We've got all the time in the world. No point taking damage. Right, so he's gonna keep attacking. So we do need to do something about it. And we do have three daggers, so we can do straight 15 damage, which is nice. Why don't we just eight? And then dagger. Uh, a dagger. And dagger. Uh, yeah. Attack for nine. We don't want to... We do not want to take 18 damage. So we're going to have to block. We're going to have to block. We're going to take eight it's gonna hurt us. It's gonna hurt. This is only ever gonna trigger with backflip right now. So we still got dagger. Can we kill him? We can't do ten. Oh, we can, cause we can. We have to strike with this boy. Yes. Oh, Whew. Okay. I was gonna try and wait a couple. Oh, five space is even better. Then try and wait a couple of turns, see if you were going to go back to sleep. You did not seem interested in that. Um, okay, so... Touch to gain a gem. Excuse me. How do... Alright, oh, yeah, we need to go all the way around. So now, what we want to do... Wait, no, we want to go here. We want to try and... Connect... To this. And we are blocked still. Okay, this is awkward. <laughs> This is pretty awkward, I see. I would like to be able to chop down trees. Is that an ability I can find? And you, sir, do you remove cards from my deck, please? Uh, you sell items also when you play... all oh, artifacts, okay. So when you play a ranged card, deal five damage to all enemies. Yeah. Aggressive spirit. And they do what? Deal damage equal to ally spirit. Okay, so it's going to do 4 through 2 room damage, it sounds like. All of the equipped heroes cards gain retain. Interesting. What's this? Oh, it adds charge and combo. Attacks also damage adjacent enemies. So these are epic ones. And retain ranged. Okay. I do like burst. Stone. I think we're going to have to save up for that for sure. Battle Brother. Um, ally, aggressive, chat. So, yeah, we know he's an ally. Aggressive means we actually attack them as well with the spirit power. Then charge. By playing it, you charge forward. Interesting. Add Shara's power to this. Oh, God. Okay. So, he could do four plus the... Is it three? Yeah, so he'll do seven and then six. Okay. Interesting. He's nice. I like I like look of him. This is great. This is great. This is draw and block. This is what we want. But I don't know how to remove cards yet. Uh, and that's gonna be an issue. This this page would be nice. We need a lot. We need a lot of gold. Um so let's we're gonna have to go fight some elites. See what we can do. We've got a heal in here. Ten to each. We don't need it right now, but there is something special over there we want to try and go get. This is... <laughs> I don't want it to show parts I've already seen. I need to go, like, right out onto the edge of something here. 
be as efficient as possible. God, it's right up in that corner, isn't it? Okay, blobs. We got wisps. This enemy intends to attack. This would be nice to be able to do damage to them all, for sure. Um, oh. Okay, what's that? 24 damage? 22 damage, sorry. You're not going to block. We can block 18. We can block everything, but then we're not going to do any damage at all. I don't know if that's the right thing to do. 18, 24 damage is quite a lot. Well, if we let this guy tank a bit, that should be okay. So let's do this. We'll guard. We'll huddle. Oh, he gets plus two anyway. Oh, I didn't do it. I, I did it the wrong way around, so he didn't get the extra. Three block. Oh, stupid. Okay. Well, obviously we want to play this. Retreat. Less us teamwork. Okay, so we... Oh, well, defense fine. Play the outlaw again because of the gem. Got to love that. Why not? Um... Combo, defend, attack. It's all the same, really, at this point. Let's use it anyway. And then we'll attack. Um, and we can't use that, so might as well defend. I wish this would gain retain, but it's gone. Maybe we'll get lucky. So I guess the outlaws get removed from your deck anyway, so actually we, we do make the deck significantly smaller with that. Right. Another big hit. It's going to be 10, that's going to be 19. Hmm. If you control an ally, so we want to swap positions. We'll do this. We can dagger. We can attack you. We can gain some more block and swap back. 11. You should get two extra. Let's see. Yeah, we can take that, that's fine. Okay, well we need to kill this one for sure. Easy. We can probably almost kill that one. Don't want to take too much damage though. This will be nice. But we need to pull this off and we need to try and kill these two, so... Oh, it's going to be hard. I can't get... I have to get to the front with this. So maybe we're actually just going to kill one? Well, if we do this, we're blocking teamwork, we should actually be fine. Yep. Sweet. What is this shield they've got around them? Buffing. Okay. Sweet. We've got time to attack now. Attack for four? Why is this guy weakened? Oh, he actually is weakened. One, one turn or more. Right, so let's jump to the front. Attack. Oh, they've got one-time defenses. We should have used the uh, the dagger to get rid of that. Unfortunate. Jump to the front. Oh, we dodge. God, I've got to get used to that. Not every time you use it, you jump to the front, right? For sure, what we want to do is... Retreat so powerful. I feel like we want to attack this, retreat, and then guard. No, we don't have enough block. We're not going to get enough block. Well, if we... It's going to take another damage, but I feel like we should be efficient. Nah. Nah, there's no point in going harm. We can, we can take it easy. We can do this. We can take away the stupid shield. And we can just block. Just kill them slowly. There's no point trying to push this down. They're not exactly getting stronger each turn. Okay, well. I guess strike. Lunge. Dagger. Strike. 
Get out of here. Now might be a nice time to use that heart. Heal up. Heal both, both of them up full. We'll take that, thank you. Still, tiles in a straight line. Can I still... Oh God, it's, well, I know how to get around there now. There's no blooming trees. Okay, let's use this. We should probably, even though there's another here, let's let's try and make room to the to the boss who gets me a quick escape. Oh, that's creepy. So we've got the witch from Snow White. Intends to attack. Whenever this takes damage, lose two power this turn. I lose two power, or this person loses two power. I'm not sure. So what we're gonna do is find out. That loses two power per turn, so that's great. Good for us to know. Unfortunately, we want to defend. <laughs> Do we want these outlaws though? We want to defend, we don't want to take that much damage, but that's that's good. 37! Okay. Um Oh jeez. Right, well. Let's get this to the front. Let's dagger. We want to... We want a kickflip, we want this, and then we can't kickflip after that. This is going to put us to the front also. Well, no, we want to, we want to kickflip. And we're just going to have to tank some. What's this? Vulnerable. Ooh. Teamwork. We're just going to have to take some hits. It'll go up, 17. So I've got four damage. This person is <laughs> is really strong. All right. Ah, okay. Attack. Dagger. Dagger helps, especially when it's times three, because um, it's gonna drop it down by well times three. Uh, might as well attack again. We're gonna have to guard. He's got plenty of health. He can tank some damage. And he gets two extra. Oh, a big hit though. Alright, they're gonna buff. This is our chance to do some damage. Attack. Attack. Defend so I can get to the front and then use my dagger to attack again. Right. Can we get him this turn? Have we got a kickflip? Yes, we do. So we have a dagger. We have a strike. And then we're just gonna... Oh no, she's got the shield. I'm not even looking. I'm an idiot. Oh, this is gonna hurt. This is gonna really hurt. I have to... Wow. Not looking at the shield after she just did that. Well, that was a lot of damage. We're gonna have to rest up somewhere, somehow. This person has to die this round. Get out of here. God, that were a big one. That were a hard fight. Awesome. Can I find out what... Right, so well, let's get this. We'll get the paintbrush. We know what the paintbrush does. Gain a brush, start each chapter with an additional brush. We like that. What does this do? It's just plus one paper for now, so it does nothing. There's another elite fight over there. I'm rather worried. I would really like to go do this thing, but it's impossible to get around here. We can use his brushes now, I guess. Nice. And uh, we have more alchemists. I'd Still, that's a lot of money, man. It's a lot of money. And I still can't get around here, can I, because of that bush? Oh my god, you have to go all the way around the side. Oh my god. Right. It's a lot of these alchemists that we're uncovering. I'm not going to be able to get to that stone over there. Heels. Ooh, that's pretty nice. And I shouldn't have picked that. I didn't want that. This would have been excellent. Yeah, 
yeah, this this is what I wanted for sure. And it says it's by the way that is when you unlock 18 cards. So actually, you kind of want a bigger deck so you get the bigger unlocks, which is very weird for a deck builder. Deck builders usually want to slim down. So strange. Right, well we're gonna have to jump onto this one and pray. 147. Can you do for us anything for us? 147. Come on. Yes, we want the burst stone. I like that a lot. Oh, I like this there. Uh, and I really like this block and it adds two random cards to your hand. Uh, gain eight. Eight, eight what? Oh, gain eight mana. Wow, okay. Dissolve every card you play this turn. Jeez. Let's just go with the straight upgrade net for now. And we want to probably put that on something insane like kickflip. Yeah. Yeah, we want we want that. We want to just hit everything with that. It's the biggest hit here we have, so. Might be worth saving in the future. When the full game's out, it might be better to save for a better card for sure, but let's just see where we can get. Right, well, we need to take these little monkeys out. They look like um, the children of Blanca from Street Fighter. And this is just hideous. All right, so he's going to do 20. When an ally dies, gains four power, but he skips the next turn. So we really want to kill someone this turn. Unfortunately, we got screwed. We have too much block. This is not going to end well. This is not going to end well. We need two. Oh, to really make this work, we're going to have to huddle, defend, teamwork. It's the only way. And it's barely going to stop anything. Ooh, that hurt. What is this? A debuff. Right, this gives us an opportunity to do some damage. Please. Yes, I need both of you out. Um, six. You know what? Yep. Block what we can. We'll block it. We'll look. Oh, actually, so not bad. We go up to nine. So that guy's stunned. Now, let's lunge. Dagger you. We're gonna strike you, and we're gonna kick flip you. So he's weakened because we've done a lot of damage as well. Uh, excuse me, what happened to weaken? I think you're supposed to be attacking this guy and taking out these little ones to stun him when you really want to stun him. Because 28 is massive. Uh, oh dear. And I can't even bring her to the front. Wow, we've got some bad draws here. I need to bring her to the front so I can use huddle and teamwork, but I can't. So, we're just going to huddle and teamwork anyway, just with less... Less power. Could we have used this? I don't. I don't know if that counts as her card. Oh, it does. Maybe we should have done that. Okay. Well, he's going to debuff, so we have a chance. We have a chance. We want to see that kick flip. There we go. We want to see that lunge. There we go. Lunge. Dagger. Dagger. Strike. There you go. Kick flip. Crack. And uh, why not just gain seven block? No, oh, we don't have any mana, that's why not. Fifteen, okay. We've got him now. How many cards do we draw? Turn six. It's just five. Oh, but we get the dagger, right. So we want to defend. We want to dagger. We want 16 times two. Alright, so we got. Hmm, damn. We've only got five, so we have an extra ten. Once again. We want to use this no matter what. Fifteen. God, 
we're still here. Another 17 on block. We're gonna get another 7, but he's gonna do for 10 damage. Well, 8 damage, I guess, because we didn't go back to him. Quick math. Right, we've got a game. Get me to the front. Yes, get daggered, you slime ball. Sweet, sweet. Okay. This card's attack hits all enemies. <laughs> Isn't that just what we did? That's what we paid all that money for. You gotta be kidding me. Give me that paper. I don't know what it does, but it's gotta be good. There's no heals. We've been very unlucky, very unfortunate here. Man, I really want to get down there to those coins and stuff, but it's not going to happen, is it? Nope. Nope, it's not. How unfortunate. All right, and this uh, boss in this direction, because it knows we've got no paint left. Okay, so, also that are neighboring enemies, but this is all enemies. What if? Huh. Excuse me. Uh, hits all enemies. I think we have to save this. Lunge is nice. Lunge is really nice. Does it do that much? 11. To all enemies. I feel like we should save that for a... For a better card. Does this guy have the better card? Attack for seven and add a dagger, that's nice. Uh really like this still. We have no money, we have nothing. Quick strike, I don't think it's worth it. Yeah, we're just gonna have to go and get creamed by this boss. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. No more healing. I tried. I tried, guys. I tried, but there's too many freaking ruins blocking my path. Oh, jeez. Here we go. Right. Well, if I strike you, then I teamwork you. Then I strike you again. I'll be out. At least it's just one guy. I bet he calls him back up, though. He's going to buff himself. All right. All right. This is fine. Because what we want to do, that 15 damage is there. We want to defend. So that we get extra damage. We do 18 damage. There we go. This guy, we're going to have to tank some damage for this guy now though. Well, if we have to. We want the outlaws out there to start getting the dags, but also slim the deck. And do 8 damage. So what we can do is lunge. Defend. Five. Yeah, yeah. Defend twice for sure. So he's going to keep getting stronger. Yeah, 18 now. And then we can dagger you. 18. I can't have this guy die. I want to do this extra damage. I'm going for it. We're just gonna block for seven, see. Oh no, it goes up, what am I talking about? Why did he, oh, because we weakened him because we did the kickflip. Oh, I've got to remember that, that's excellent. 33% less damage is pretty sweet. So actually we're gonna take nothing this turn, fantastic. Fantastic. Yeah, I gotta remember that mace, that's, that's pretty fantastic. Right, he's gonna buff again. So, we wanna get back to the front. We want a dagger, we want a strike. Uh, there really is nothing else to do, why not? Why not do nothing? He's not going to hurt us. And then we can use the dagger straight away next turn. 10. So, we want to dagger you. We want to strike you. We want to strike you. And here's the interesting bit. We're going to defend and we're just going to take some hits because we want, we want to save uh, Sirocco, Frogman over here. Ooh, she's been weakened though, that's not good, we can't have that. He's gonna do way more. Oh, I guess enragement under half life, right? Well, should've known. Let's go for this. 
We're gonna go for this. We're gonna go for this. And we're gonna go for the block. What do you keep her alive? We did weaken him. She's safe. Uh, and that vulnerable will run out, run out in a sec. Uh, we've got him down to 70. Uh, 24. Not gonna die, but it's gonna be close. He's gonna debuff, all right. That's, that's a chance for us to get some work done. Unfortunately, it's not a great chance because we haven't got anything. Right, he's gonna debuff me. Ooh, 43. I wonder if you die, if you die, you die, you die, you die forever, and then we get a new character or something like that. But, for now, let's just focus on Getting as much damage as we can, and we're gonna sack Sirocco. <laughs> Sorry, buddy, but you're gonna you're gonna get crushed. Well, anyway. Oh no, we got some wounds added. Whoa! Sing this song three more times to revive. Oh, that's cool. Unfortunately, we have no time for that. We have to defend as much as possible. We need that kick. Oh my god, please. Oh, it gives us a turn. It gives us a turn. Right, so that's 18. We need 7 damage. We've got it. Get out of here, you rat king. Sweet. Let's fuel up. We made it. We made it through. Oh, a choice. Nice. Whenever the equipped hero plays a card that costs two or more, draw two cards. Interesting. At the start of each battle, the equipped hero gains protection. Protection is prevent the first damage. Also nice. Um, and these equip to a hero as well, so that's a nice thing. It's not a card. Start of each battle, add a random card of the equipped hero to your hand. It costs zero. That's nice. Protection's very nice. Um, honestly, I think I'm going to go with this protection. I think I need the, the zero cost card. Could be really sweet. But it could also be garbage. This is always going to be useful. This might also be bad. In certain situations, I guess. Protection. She has less health, and I think that's just that just means a lot. Right, so we get another scroll. Two. We get some coins, we get some brushes. Five for the next world, I guess. We should get an extra one, right? I guess we start with four, but now we get five because of this. And now... Oh, right. Upgrades. If this card... If this card blocked, deal damage to the leading enemy equal to the amount blocked. So we could do 10 damage with that pretty much every turn. Or we can get all three of these cards, which is ranged, gain... Interesting. We can get a free energy. 7 block, 2 courage. Courage is... Extra energy also. 7 block, retain a card in your hand. We have, it's all really good, but we have a lot of block. I actually want to drop cards, but this is also, this would also give us another buff. Because uh, we currently have 14. Oh no, it wouldn't give us a buff. It would be very close though. This is a constant effect on a card. If we did that on teamwork, 10 block, it'd be 10 block almost every time, 10 damage extra every time we use it. This is no damage. And it's going to fill his hand up a lot more. It's, it's okay getting more energy and getting more energy, but if we don't have the cards to play, there's really no point. So, let me go with that for now. I said we were going to save this. This is going to go straight onto teamwork. And you know what? That'd do 10 damage to all enemies as well, every time we used it to block. Uh... It's got attacks, so it's got block deal damage, yeah, so I don't think that counts as an attack. I wouldn't count it as an attack, so I'm not going to do that right now. I'm going to wait for another card still. Uh, right, let's continue. Next world, next area. Lost in the Oversky. Okay. Cool. New world. Let's draft a card straight off the bat. Give me a card. The next card you play costs three less this turn. Well, that's that's incredibly powerful if we have very strong cards. Quick Strike's cool, man. It's 
3 damage, but this is extra mana to get some stuff done, so I'm going to go with that. Because we do usually end up with a card or, or two at the end of the turn, so why not? Can I spend these pieces of paper, dude? Okay. What we're we saving up for here? Combo, game one courage. Uh, what's the point? Oh, because it, yeah, it costs one less. Uh, for each ally in play, attack for one. No. We don't have an ally deck. Ally, activate, gain two. Once per turn. Use this. Can I? So I can trigger that when I want? Is that what that's saying? Because that's cool, but it is a three cost. But then I also I get four back. That's, a, that's an investment. Uh, melee, gain block equal to the size of your draw pile. Mm, not great right now. We have a small deck. Uh, we have what, 15 cards? Yeah. So if you, if you draw five, we're going to have 10 at the most and. You know, most of the time we're not going to have that. Attack a random enemy for three. Repeat for each card you've played this turn. Probably going to only play two or three cards a turn, so three, six, nine. It's, it's okay. It's okay. If the equipped hero played no cards this turn, draw three additional cards next turn. Ugh. Alchemists cost half as much. They are expensive. Whenever the equipped hero kills an enemy, gain 10 gold. Ooh, I like that. Melee, one energy less when played from the front. Interesting. Two spirit. Oh, you can give it an ally. Ooh. If we, no, we've already done it to that one ally. We've already, he's only got one space. Whenever you draw this, reduce its cost by one. Whenever you, so would that, if that was on a 5 cost, it would go down by 1 each time it came through the deck? I'm not sure exactly. I do like Scobold Fetish, though. It's going to help us buy a lot more stuff. And we could put it on, a, on our... Uh, on Shara, the, the Dragon Slayer. Let's, let's, let's save for that for now. Let's say that that's where we're headed. Um, Crumbling Golem. What is this? Whenever the heroes play a card... Take 4 damage. Is that me taking 4 damage or is that you taking 4 damage? It's on him, so I assume it's him, but it's, it seems weird, man. Yeah, he took 4, so... There we go. Alright, so it's going to do, do 10 every time, that's fantastic. And we're going to use this, why not, uh, so that we can strike and then... Uh, oh no, we don't want to... We don't want to do this right now. You know what? Yeah, we do. Because we're still going to have the same. It's going to do an extra far to him. Twelve. Okay, so we're fighting against the clock. It looks like... Ooh. Unblocked damage. Excuse me. I can't block any damage. Is that for real? Well, um, I'm going to try anyway. To see if that makes sense. Uh, that should have been 11, shouldn't it? Why the heck was that not 11? If you control an ally. I'm pretty sure I was in charge of an ally. But okay. It's going to go up to 9 anyway. And take 3 damage. Maybe just straight 12 damage. Okay, I don't get that. Outlaw. Great against this guy. So we want to defend. We want to backflip, flip, and we're going to defend again. Sweet. These daggers are going to be insane. So let's, let's lunge. Lovely. And we have two more, so why don't we... Oh, he's weakened. So now if we do this, we're going to have 11. And we do this, he's going to die. 4 and 4. Sweet. Basic golem. I wonder how long this demo is. This is, uh, this is pretty nice. Touch the game. I mean, you obviously only get one character, but this is, this is a preview for the demo that's coming out in like 5 hours. Not for the, uh, the Steam kind of demo. 
event. I want to also try floppy knights from, from Dice of Dungeons. Gain a hero, give a hero three power, dissolve. Okay, so destroy the card after you've used it. Mm. Ally, both heroes gain spirit, a power equal to the mentor spirit, so they start with two power extra and they're going to go to one. Does this make it good? Let me look at the cards. This says loses one spirit at the end of the at the beginning of the turn. This does not. So what I'm assuming is this guy just straight gives us two extra power. Attack all enemies for fourteen is. Mm. What are the upgrades that we have? Attack hit all enemies. So that that'd be useless on that anyway. So. Hmm. Still, this is probably the best. You know what? This is a one cost that makes everything plus two damage for the rest of the fight. Uh, I'm going to skip it for now. Oh, you lose it forever. Oh, my God. Okay. Well, we learned something. We learned something. Orgato, whenever the equipped hey, I was reading that. Whenever the equipped hero plays a card that costs two or more, deal five damage from. Interesting. Whenever you deal damage more than one enemy when you damage more than one enemy with a single card, draw a card, it costs one less this turn. That's very that's what we want to head for. Uh... Oh, it's a sky tile! How are we so unlucky? How are we so unlucky with this? Uh, okay, we just... Oh my... Oh my god! <laughs> Douchebag! Come back here immediately. Oh no. I can't believe you've done this to us. I can't believe you've done this. How dare you! It's all my, all my paintbrush just to go fight. Right, well, don't skip anyway. Charge, attack leading enemy for 12. Yeah. Attack twice for damage equal to the size of your drop. That's better because it's twice. Um, we're going to go with this. I like it. And we're going to see if we can pop off with this. Where is it going? Is it again? Could be grass. Hits all enemies, so it could should be doing a... The more cards we get, the better that is. Can't believe this guy took us... I know we have to do a battle just to get to him. Sure. Let's see what we've got here. Okay, spiky blue boys. Seek revenge if their friend is killed. Alright, so we... <laughs> Well, the trick, I guess, is to try and kill them both at the same time, but that means we've got to keep up with a lot more. This is going to be nice, because she's also doing extra damage, so we want to do this anyway. That was... Why was that so good? Attack twice. Okay, yeah, for damage. So that that's, that's pretty nuts so far. Um, we do want to... Teamwork. Uh, and ranged makes it cheaper. Yeah. So we might as well lunge. Right, we've evened the health out a little bit. We're going to teamwork. We're going to outlaw. We're going to outlaw. We're going to get damaged. We're going to get some pretty serious damage. But we had no other block, so... That's what we could do. It's what we had to do. It's what we had to do. Adrenaline. Why not? Don't get destroyed anyway. Um, we... Ooh. Should probably do everything. Dagger. Onto you. Strike. You. Uh, we're gonna... Defend. <laughs> we're still gonna get... 
Uh, we're gonna take one damage. Not bad. One damage is fine. We can take a damage. He's weakened though, so we don't want him to fight anymore. Kickflip attacks is gonna hit them both, so that's pretty good. It's gonna do 18 to both of them, so we could kill this one right now. We need to get her to the front, which we cannot do, so this is actually awful. Because we also only have one defense. It's going to give us seven block. We're going to get seven damage. Right, so... We've got to hit you. We're going to have to retain it. This guy's weakened as it is. Oh, what a nightmare. Right. Shame. Really bad draws. Really bad draws. I'm going to have to fix this deck up. Can you remove cards? Where's the card removal? Okay, the draw pile is, is 10. But if we jump her out in front... Oh, he got, he got healed like crazy. So... Ooh, I don't like that he got healed so much. And... Whoa, 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 whoa. Gain 10 power? Nah, mate. Yeah, it would definitely good to make sure these guys died together. That that would have been that would have been very painful. Yeah, because we hurt them. They were attacking us. Right. I'm gonna have to disappear. Around the corner. Oh, at least we get healed. This thing rocks. Oh, we got... Uh, no, okay, so we got an extra thing. Each ally of the equipped hero gains one spirit. Well, we always want her because it's ranged, so it's going to go to her again. Oh, Sorry, Sorocco. We, we didn't need to do that right now. That was, uh, that was a bad move. You know what? Is this three tiles in a straight line? So we don't want to do it from that angle. We want to do it from, like, here. No, we don't, because of course, of course we wanted to do it, yeah, from here, just in case, but uh, not knowing where all these holes and stuff are, I tell you what, we don't stand much of a chance a lot of the time. I'm sure we'll learn, but feels bad. So, a llama unicorn, a llama con, yep, of course, called it. A major debuff, and he's going to heal 10 every turn, so we need to... To do some real damage, so that's a nice start. Um, and then I guess I mean, there's really no point to doing anything else. We have to just take this debuff. Okay, now he's going to attack and debuff. He did not debuff his last time, so I don't see what that was. Oh, he gave us crap in his deck, All right? It's an awesome card. I would love a foil version of that. This, this, they need like a battle pass, right? The more you uh, use a certain card or something, you level it up and you get the foil versions. So 12. So what we want to do is and then swap out. Why 7 and why not 11? I'm very confused by this card. It If you control an ally, you gain 11 block instead. I was controlling ally. I really don't get how that card works. Well, I'm going to take damage now. I didn't expect to. Outlaw. Outlaw. We are going to do this. We're going to lunge. We're going to strike. Um, we are going to take... Oh, no. We're not going to take any damage because uh, the protection would have stopped anyway. Yeah. So there we are. We're good. This guy's going to shield and buff. So, oh my god. Dagger. Kickflip. He's really screwing with his deck right now. Uh, there's no point using it, but why not? I can't even use them. They're not even like ones that you can use to get rid of them. They're just pure garbage. He's going to keep doing this every turn. Ugh. Scared. I 
needed to be at the front. Why did I do this? Why did I do this? That's my kickflip. Okay, debuff. Right, well. Let's block. Let's strike. Let's dagger. Let's dagger. Let's strike. More cards in the deck. I wish it would show you. There's no animation for what the debuff is. It should show the card going into my discard pile or whatnot, but it's not doing that. It feels a little bit weird, to be honest. This card should do 10 damage. Uh, why not do this for no reason? 22. Okay. We do this. With dagger. Look, I'm controlling an ally right now. They're in charge. If you control an ally. Eleven! So eh! Well, I I sometimes that does not work. Maybe if it's the last card again? I, hmm, I don't I don't know, it's weird. I'm just not paying attention. What have we got? This is this is getting really, really, really bad. This guy might kill me. This guy might kill me. I really need to get back to the front. He's healing every time and now he's got defense. And his cards are just completely full. Is this an elite? Was this an elite? I don't think it was. Defense. Dagger. Dagger. And he's healing and shielding more than I'm even damaging him right now. Oh my god. I, I can't get through. Coupe de grass. Oh. Oh, beautiful. Dagger. Do it. Twice. Yes. Alright. That got to him. Um, you're going to have to tank some more health, big guy. You know what? I should have done. Oh, no, he's not. Lucky, lucky. At least this guy, at least he's weakened a little bit. Still got that healing. Lunge. Kick flip. All I can do, I'm just gonna take. Ah, uh, great. Twenty-two. Where's my coup de grass? No. Ah, I used it. I used it. What am I doing? That's an extra ten health for him because I'm an idiot. I need it. Give me a group of grass. Oh my god. Don't do this to me. Don't be doing this to me. Look how many cards you've added to my deck. Coup de grass. Coup de grass. Coup de grass. He's making coup de grass stronger for us. But, but he's also just healing every turn. Come on. And I have, I can't, I have no control over what's happening now. This is completely random. Just do as much damage as I can. Just keeps healing every turn. And he's gonna shield. I need that could be grass. I need it, and I've got a ton of cards in my draw pile. Adrenaline strike, huddle, and he's dead again. Oh, they're both dead. Oh my god, that was awful. I did not like that it wasn't showing me what he was doing. That's that's awkward. I want him to see how many cards he's adding to my pile instead of just the debuff icon. Okay, so we level him up and then we're going to unlock new cards from like Monster Train. Uh, each individual kind of... It's like a class. It is like Monster Train actually because we had this, this leader, the backup support. And, uh, you know, you mix some of their cards together and they kind of work in a different way. And I guess there's a player level as well. I suppose these uh, scrolls are to upgrade. Hey, why am I... Okay. That was the end. Progression heroes. Yep. The player and they're the cards. We can't look at anything that we're going to unlock. They have like the Ferrier backs as well. That's like the F of Ferrier. So that's funny. It's like they're actually playing Ferrier in the game. Um... 
because you do do that in fairy you actually kind of you play a card but you also build land and different land type affects people differently different uh, enemies and you can kind of block people off from certain ways or, or make quick routes to these uh these kind of gem towers it's pretty interesting okay so additional talent here choose okay mm. well let's look down here 50 gold is nice additional gem from chests whatever Replace one strike card in your deck. Okay, that's good. Final game. Final game. Fi okay, so all these are locked for now. Final game. Okay. Mm, one out of two. Oh, you need 10 pit. Oh my god, okay. Well. 30 pages. Excuse me? Oh my god. Well, it doesn't want me to get any further than this. Jeez. Okay, well, we're going to have to jump back in on another one. I'm going to stop that capture in there. Thanks. And then uh, I'll record another, another session. Thanks for watching. Bye.